Hey guys, this is Karan here. Welcome to Tech Karan YouTube channel. I'm back with a new video and today in this video we are gonna make a review of Paranoid Android Custom Room which is based on Android 10 and is available for most of the devices. I am using my Xiaomi Redmi Note 8 and I have installed Paranoid Android on my device which is based on Android 10. You get the security patch of latest 5th of March 2020 which is the latest security patch. What other things you get in Paranoid Android Custom Room and uh, Google camera is working or not. What is the Geekman score? Everything in this video so make sure you watch this video till the end let's get quickly straight to the video this is my device i am using xiaomi redmi note 8 and i am using paranoid android custom room don't worry this is only one plus wallpaper and one plus icon tag this is not one plus room the performance of the custom room is pretty much smooth you will get a lot of high type of performance here without any lags at all i have used one plus icon pack and one plus wallpapers the wallpaper app which you get by default here is abstract wallpaper app and here you get a lot of wallpapers like one plus blend paranoid craft a lot of wallpaper options are available for you so you can just go and try it out the wallpapers okay the icon pack which i have used is the oxygen icon pack from here just go and download from it from here if you want to try out this icon pack and this theme looks pretty much nice and pretty much impressive in my case okay in my opinion let's move on further and let's check out something quick and tiles colors are like green colors and here you have the option to hold and drag to add tiles not extra option of customization options are available in this custom room and here you only get the option to reset the tiles nothing else okay and now let's move on further let's check out some other things the camera app which you get by default here is the normal snapdragon camera which you get in almost all the devices also but the main thing is is google camera working or not i am using gcam 7.3 which is perfectly working without any issues at all you can see a lot of options are available if you want to try your gcam 7.3 then it's very very good thing for you that you can use gcam in your device after using this custom room that's a very very positive thing the default browser which you get here is the chromium browser that's also advanced thing because you don't get chromium browser almost in all devices but in this room you get chromium browser by default which is based on google chrome if you have no idea regarding what is chrome chromium which is based on chrome browser you can just search on google you will find it easily okay let's move on further let's check out the geekbench score in my device i am using redmi note 8 the geekbench score is very much impressive and very much good it will take some time to open as expected so we have to force close it once just wait and let me do it now let me show you the Geekbench score the Geekbench score which you get here is pretty much impressive 310 is the single core score and 1370 is the multi core score so very much good Geekbench score as you can expect from this device okay Let's move on further and let's check out. I have installed third party launcher which is launcher which was also working perfectly but the third party gesture but the full screen gesture navigation is not working in this third party launcher. So this is the thing in which you have to customize your device. Okay. So let's move on further and magic manager. You can install magic manager but you have to install it on your own. This is not pre-installed. Okay. So you have to install magisk manager on your own but that's a very good thing you can use magisk you can use magisk modules also which is working perfectly another very good thing also the by default music player which you get here is the retro music app by default retro music available here and that's another positive thing let's take a look at some features of this paranoid android custom room network and internet you have the option of mobile network wi-fi hotspot and tethering hotspot and tethering has no bug you can use usb tethering you, you can use wi-fi hotspot you can use bluetooth tethering no issues at all connected devices apps and notifications in apps and notifications you have the option of permission manager which you can use like which apps are using which location to check out how many apps and how many permissions they are getting 
battery bad, battery backup is very very great i am using this device from past 24 hours and the battery backup is very much smooth you can use you can see my screen usage only one hour and 11 minutes but i didn't got any that much battery drain so that's a very positive thing because battery draining is more important for some person display here a lot of things are available brightness level adaptive brightness screen timeout colors option is available but you cannot customize your colors there is no option to customize them but the option is available pulse option is available which you can use to choose notification color or system sn color whichever you want to use and a dark theme and ambient display option is available always on wake up both the things are working perfectly without any issues at all dark theme option is available headline body font etc are available display i've already shown you in sound you have the option of vibration and haptics which you can change these are the extra options you get here dial by tone screen locking option charging sound and vibration and all storage privacy location everything is same no things are there you don't get the face lock option here by default so that's another negative thing as you can say but that's not a big case language in system language as input and only gestures are available as you can see a lot of gestures are available like screen off gesture playback control is option is available if you want to try out screen of gesture is available only double tap to wake nothing else swipe to screenshot prevent ringing gesture navigation as you can see i am using that and only get the optional gesture bar size and options nothing else and no extra things to hide pill and extra customization options so only these are the things you get in this paranoid and custom room but the main thing is stability and it is based on android 10 so these were the, all the things which you get in paranoid android custom room this was all from today's video. I hope you like it. Thanks for watching. Goodbye. See you in the next video very soon.